Today we're gonna to show you how to test a solar panel. Basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna test the voltage and the amperage of the solar panel. And what you see here is the junction box and also the tag from Gensi. The tag will have some information on it. For instance, the, v, the VIC and also the uh, amperage that this solar panel is supposed to give out. So first what we have to do is we have to connect uh, our voltage meter to the solar panel and the easiest way to do this is by utilizing the existing wires that the junction box comes with basically you have to identify that this is the negative and this is the positive positive. and we went ahead and connected uh, both terminals here to the voltage meter and we'll go ahead and show you how to test with this voltage meter in just a second. What we're gonna do is we're gonna throw this solar panel on top of the Jeep just so that it can be laying flat and we'll show you the numbers that the solar panel gives out. All right, so the two things that we'll be doing today is testing for the VOC, which is the voltage of the solar panel, which is listed right here at 21.6, and the amperage. Essentially what we need to do is we need to be getting that exact number or just below that number. Uh, and that would basically identify if this panel is really giving out the power that it's uh, essentially advertising that it will give out. So we'll go ahead and get the test started. Okay, so we have the solar panel right now on top of the Jeep. And essentially we have connected to our voltage meter. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna show you how to test the solar panel utilizing the voltage meter. All right, so to test the solar panel, first you have to go ahead and insert the terminals uh, correctly. First we'll start with the ground, which is the black wire, and it goes into the comm section. And then we'll be testing for voltage, so you have to vo find the voltage, uh, uh, basically a plug-in for the terminal, which as you can see there, there's a V next to the voltage. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and turn on uh, the power of the system and then we have to set the dial to the voltage setting and remember we have to set it to whatever is higher than the voltage that the solar panel is uh, uh, recommended to be given out so for instance in this scenario we have 2 20 and 200 we know that it gives out more than 20 so we have to put it on a 200 and as you can see there it's given out a 20.2 which is very close to what the manufacturer is recommending based on where the sun is positioned, if we move the solar a little bit. You might see some differences in the output. And uh, that's how you essentially go about testing the voltage of the solar panel. So now we'll go ahead and take you through testing the amperage. So the first thing you have to do is move the uh, positive terminal into the amperage section. As you can see there, it says 20 amp. And then we have to move the dial into the amperage setting as well. Obviously the amperage was uh, somewhere around 5.8. And as you can see, we listed it on the 20 amp here. Here's the amperage sign. And we have it on a 20 amp. And as you can see, it's listing 5.9 amps, which is exactly what it should be given out. So that concludes our testing for the solar panel. Uh, please remember that the solar panel has to be clean uh, for it to actually uh, give you the correct results and it has to be directly pointing towards the sun. And uh, thank you very much for watching.